When studying for your theory test and coming across road signs, do you feel like this? In this video, I'm gonna break down the shapes and colors for you to give you a head start. So you go from feeling like this to this. Yes! Hi, I'm Dorian from Dorian Think Success. The biggest issue we have when we run our courses every week on the theory chat, fairy side of things is people struggle with road signs they really really struggle with road signs so i thought i'd do a video i'm going to break down the colors and shapes for you um, to give you a head start with your studying starting with a red triangle red triangles are warnings warning you of a problem or a hazard relating to the theory test when you're doing your hazard perception when you see a sign in your hazard perception you should be clicking your mouse button in real life driving you should be checking the mirrors remember clicking on the hazard perception on the ferry test relates to you checking the mirrors so triangles are warnings blue circles are instructions positive instruction that's the way it comes up on the ferry test they normally give you those two options those are the common two instructions or positive instructions over the last six to eight weeks, based on what I'm seeing and the feedback we get from our pupils after the test theory test, they're starting to use the word the mandatory for the blue circles. Now, they'll only give you one out of the three. So it's either gonna be instructions, positive instructions, or mandatory they're starting to use. If you're using the apps, especially the, the four in one driving test success, that has been updated to so start using the word mandatory. And then you have the red circles, which, is, are, which are your orders. Do not do. A little tip for you, 95% of red circles are no's. So if you get a red circle and you don't know what it means, don't stress. Just go to your options of A, B, C, D. Isolate the two with no's. They always just give you two with no's. And then from that point onwards, you just go back to the image and work it out from the two no's. Um, it becomes easy then because um, it's not that difficult because the two no's are totally opposite to each other to be fair so you can't really go wrong once you remember 95% of red circles are no's so hopefully you got some useful um, advice from this video if you did like comment and subscribe watch this video explaining road signs in a bit more detail